Hey guys, over the winter I threw together this scooter. Um, it used to be an old electric one. It had uh, two, two 12 volt batteries in the tray there, so it was 24 volt. Um, but it died, so I put this electric motor on it. Um, I've been using it for probably 10 years as an electric bike and it was really good, but it just got worse and worse over the years. I replaced the throttle a couple of times and uh, the controller eventually crapped out so I I bypassed it and put a just a push button up here with a um, with a car starter solenoid down there and so it was like direct on and off and that worked pretty good and then the, eventually the batteries died so I put the two car batteries on it right here on the footboard and that worked good for a while and then the the motor crapped out eventually and I pieced it together a couple of probably three or four times just nursing it back to life but eventually just disintegrated inside from riding it in the winter and it was just corroded to death so I couldn't fix it anymore so I I didn't want to buy a new one because they're probably they're like 40 bucks or something so I took the engine off the crazy cart and I'll probably scrap the rest of that because it wasn't that fun but um, this will be better so I uh, it used to have a same wheel as that in here in the back but uh, I put this one on here it's got a disc brake on it the old one had a, a little band brake and this one has a ratcheting thing on the wheel so I could free ride, free coast it downhill and stuff. And the old one had a had the free wheel on the motor. So I wanted it on the wheel again, so I, I used this one and that gave me a little more room here to keep the motor lower anyway. And I put this jack shaft on it. It's got a I'll have to calculate the gear ratio and let you know. I forget what it was. Um, but it works really good. Uh, I didn't have a the factory tank anymore, so I fitted this one on here. I put the gas tank on the on the wheelie horse tractor. So um, this one's from a comes a snow blower. And I left the the muffler the way I had it on the crazy cart. That works fine down there. And I made this cover here for the clutch. So I don't have chain get caught in the chain or anything. Still got that little exposed bit there but that's okay. And the governor's not in it either. Put a bolt in the hole there. Um, the I made this the kill switch. Just a button there so I can kill it while I'm rolling. And that's about it. This is all adjustable. I made these brackets. And I made this sprocket from scratch too. I, I uh took one off of a different mini bike and so I could copy it just clamped them together and grinded it all around and came up with a sprocket that fit that alright, show you how it works